annual meteor shower. It's expected to peak this weekend. It's sending streaks of light across our skies, or what we see as shooting stars, actually. Brian Hackney has details on the best time to watch it all. Meet Saul Garcia, owner of Elena's Rock Shop. When I bought it, I named it after my wife. <laughs> Inside. I do have some stones in here. Quite the collection. Well, this right here is a fossil. It's a sea clams, the shells. Dog tooth calcite. Mm -hmm. This is fluorite. Did you know about rocks before you bought the shop? Nothing. <laughs> Saul has owned the shop for three years. This is green tourmaline, rose quartz, caramel calcite. Beautiful. I love the color. All of these are rocks that formed in the earth. This is my personal one. Highlight opal from Mexico. Ooh. But there are also rocks that fell from the sky. This is a meteorite from Argentina. A meteorite survives its plunge from space to Earth, sometimes with a bang. But most of the time, they just burn up in the sky. Meteors. And they make for a great light show, like this weekend's Perseid meteor shower. The Perseids are one of the best showers always in the year of various meteor showers that the Earth runs into. Astronomer Scott Hildreth explains that what the Earth is running into over the weekend is debris left behind by a comet. Debris no bigger than grains of sand slamming into Earth at 130,000 miles an hour. And as they do that, they heat up the air and the air glows. And what we see is a streak of light across the sky. The best thing to do is to look after midnight when our moon will have set so the sky will be as dark as possible and good dark skies you can see as many as a hundred an hour that's almost two or three a minute as for the usual astronomy gear you don't want binoculars you don't need a telescope this is a very democratic phenomenon everybody can enjoy it including scott himself you still go out and take a look yourself absolutely and i will grab neighbors whether they want to come or not i'll take family members out it is pretty fascinating when you think about it these are amazing little remnants of the beginning of the solar system it's one of the reasons why astronomers still to this day we still get excited because if you could find a meteorite you're literally holding a piece of the history of the solar system the Chabot Space and Science Center in Oakland is having this watch party for the meteor shower Sunday night at 11 o'clock.